Number 42, we must simplify this. Okay, so the first thing I do is I know I'm going to factor anything I can factor. So this top right here can break down what multiplies together give you 20, yet adds to give you 12. You should see an x plus 2 and x plus 10 because 2 times 10 is 20 and 2 plus 10 is the 12. Down at the bottom, 3 and 12 both have a 3 that can factor out and that'll leave an x plus 4 because 3 times x is 3x and 3 times a 4 is 12. The division will change the multiplication. That x plus 4 in the denominator will now move to the numerator and the numerator will move to the denominator. And now we're simply going to cross out anything that's the same up top and down below. I notice x plus 2. That number would be the same as that number right there. And x plus 4 in the bottom here would be the same as that number up top there. And anything divided by itself is going to be 1. So they cross out and technically are becoming 1s. So what do we have left up top? An x plus 10. And in the bottom, 3 times 1 times 1, 3. And there we have it simplified. We should state what's excluded. I told you you didn't have to worry about it, but here we will state it since you're watching the video. Right here, this disappeared. We got to make sure that x plus 4 was not ever allowed to be a 0 because it disappeared and nobody could notice that. Negative 4 is one solution that can't happen. And here the x plus 2, so a negative 2 was another excluded value that you wouldn't notice unless, you know, you went back to the original problem and tried to put those in. So this is what I'm looking for, but this is something you should make note of and know and understand.